Okay, so we'll begin. Sit comfortably, pay attention to the sensation of the feet on the floor. If you sit cross leg, feel your bottom on the cushion. And pay attention to the uh, spine, come over the bar, that uh, no, no effort, if possible. And as I said, the eyes can be closed or open in peripheral view. And we have really three steps. I made the title called Three Steps. The first steps we connect to our body the way we connect, we know it. So we use attention. Tension is like emptiness. So if you raise your right hand like this, and you pay attention to the hand. Maybe after a while, you'll have sensation in the hand. Maybe a prickly sensation, maybe heat, or cold, or pain. Or maybe you don't feel anything. You just know you're paying attention to the hand. So the emptiness of your attention calls the energy. It's the void, the void. Uh, the void pulls in creation or energy. Or well, we can put the hand down. So in the same way, pay attention to the left hand. and see if there's any sensation there. And very gently put your left hand on the navel center, it's around the navel, maybe a bit below, and see if you feel anything when the left hand touches the navel center, if you have any sensation there. And next, we pay attention to the navel center and we take the left hand away from the navel center. Put it anywhere you want. And we allow this attention, this emptiness in the navel center to expand downwards. It's like the emptiness goes all the way down to the feet. And this emptiness from the navel center, which uh, includes all the lower part of the body, soon will pull in some energy, so we'll have some sensations there, impressions of ourselves, of our body. And maybe the impression of our lower body is different from what we know or the way we know our lower body. If the eyes are closed, maybe we feel uh, the lower body more bigger because we will not see the borders of the physical body, we just feel the energy. Next, we'll move the attention to the crown. Crown in French, la couronne, la couronne. It's not the virus. Maybe it is the virus because according to Castaneda's tradition, human beings were taken captive by what they call inorganic beings, which control our mind, which is here. And they say all our energy centers spiral, except this one, which like, moves like a pendulum because it is, it is uh, controlled by these other beings. And when we practice, whatever we practice, our discipline, 
when we keep on meditating, practicing, makes our energy unpalatable, not tasty for these creatures. So they let us go and then this will begin to turn in a spiral way. Well, that's what they say, I don't know how it is really. And we, from here, we expand, extend our sphere of awareness downwards to the head, neck, shoulders, chest, abdomen, and then the lower abdomen where the navel center is, pelvis, hips, thighs, knees, calves, ankles, and feet. And in this way, we are more attentive to our whole body. Pay attention to your whole body. This is the first step. What makes us whole is the emptiness, the emptiness that, that uh, contains all the impressions we have. And the second step, second step is to connect to the earth, which is a very high being. It is our world. And we connect to the earth by allowing the vibrations that vibrate inside our energy sphere to align with the same vibrations in the earth. And the earth, I don't mean only the physical part of the earth because there's the atmosphere of the earth also. Uh, we talked, or I talked, <laughs> that we can connect to the earth energy through our whole body because we are surrounded by earth energy. Like being in a womb, like being in a warm bath. So this is, in, in, in a way, you can describe it as outward outside of us and then we can allow the earth energy to go inside of us usually we allow it to go in through our through our feet the kidney one point which is called in chinese the bubbling spring bubbling spring and the energy comes from the feet and the it fills us up, fills the feet, the ankles, Shavin, and goes up the calves, Mule, and fills up the knees, Genu, and goes up to fill the thighs <clears throat> and the pelvis, Quis Pasa. Uh, if we, and then the lower abdomen, where the, it's called the middle disc, where the navel center is, and then the upper abdomen, uh, the chest, quatrine, and the <clears throat> shoulders as a pole. And then the energy fills up the, the arms, bras, bras, the bras, all the way to the tip of the fingers. And then fills the, the neck and head. So we are filled with earth energy inside and 
we are covered with this same energy from the outside. And I always emphasize that even though we are surrounded by earth energy and we are filled up with earth energy, still there's something unique which belongs to us, what we call our individuality. I don't know what it is. So this is the second step. And the third step <clears throat> is to connect with the other practitioners. This is done by extending our sphere of awareness, our empty bubble or empty or bubble of attention to include everybody, all the participants, using our intent. And by intending it, we create rapport with all the other people. So in a way, we share emptiness, but this emptiness brings some very fine energy which circulates among us, between us. So these are the three steps. And now it took us, I don't know how long, 10 minutes, maybe more to practice it, but we can do it in a few seconds. So we we'll use the click method this day. And first click, try to be aware of yourself. Second click, connect to the earth. And the third click, we connect to each other, creating a pole. And now, just experience yourself and the others and the earth. And if your eyes are closed, allow them to open gently. and see the difference when they're open. And you'll find that you can still be aware of yourself. Okay. 